This is Jordan Tao with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. Check out, Check the, out the new video, video by Gutter Snipes, Snipes featuring Rock to Star HNWB out now, streaming on all platforms. And make sure you smash that like button. Let's get right into the news. Let's talk about Irv Gotti. I cannot believe this. I watched more of this interview. He told Ja Rule right to his face, you ain't getting your masters back, buddy. Now, I'm going to be honest with you, okay? Irv Gotti is just a POS, okay? We thought it was bad that he was uh, going out of shock to you the way, the way he was. Dude, he disrespected Ja Rule to his face, and Ja Rule was so soft he did nothing. He said nothing, okay? Uh, ja Rule was like, you know, every artist would like to get his masters back, right? Um, but, you know, if you don't, you know, it's like whatever. Then Irv Gotti was like, make new masters. Make new masters. You ain't getting your masters back, okay? So, but, but, and Ja Rule was like, see, there you have it. Now, Ashanti, he was very mad that Ashanti's re-recording her masters. Uh, Irv Gotti's like a savage. He's no different than, than the... The guys screwing people over that work at, uh, you know, at the labels. You know, he's just he just comes from the same element and is d d messing over his own people. He's not empowering people to, you know, own their masters and go independent. Do that. He wants to control people. Uh, he wants to have people do what he says and work for him. He's not trying to empower people around him. Okay, he's not. He's just not. Uh, he didn't like it when Ashanti left, when when he was, you know, he mixed business and pleasure and their relationship fell apart. And he he got a, he got real emotional, like a little baby when he also had a wife. OK, he was cheating on his wife with Ashanti. And when their relationship didn't work out, he said, go, go, go record at Nelly's studio. Don't record here anymore. What is she supposed to do? She's supposed to leave at that point. OK. He turned her his back on her. She didn't turn her back on him. Just like he turned his back on J-Lo when J-Lo showed him love and brought him to another level. You know, like, this guy has a reputation of blackballing 50 Cent, keeping people out that he didn't like. Uh, you know, he, he hypes up that he was this big uh, guy in the street when he wasn't. Okay, he was affiliated with Supreme. This guy's just a piece of garbage, to be honest, to be honest with you. He sold all their masters for $300 million. Didn't even cut Ja Rule in the deal. That wasn't mentioned once during the, the whole thing. Ja Rule didn't get a penny out of that. A penny! Ja Rule got no money out of the $300 million. Ja, Irv Gotti just said, don't worry, I'll take care of putting some of these movies because you know I'm going to reinvest it and put it in movies. He told Ja Rule to his face, you're not getting your master's back. I mean, would you be friends with somebody like that that doesn't even have your best interest at all? Yeah, he, he, Ir, Ja Rule was talented, and Irv Gotti did a lot of amazing things with Jay-Z, DMX, and Ja Rule. But, you know, it's not like he was empowering these people to like be independent and do their own thing. He was really like, hey, you need me, um, and without me, you're nothing. That's basically how he looked at everything. So let's not let's not dress it up like you know he did amazing things, but he's also a scumbag, just like everybody else, you know. Um, and then you know he talked about the whole uh, Dame Dash and uh, uh, Dame Dash versus Jay Z thing. Basically said, you know, Leo Cohen probably got in the middle of that and said, told Jay Z, hey, do you, are you comfortable splitting this three ways and put a divide? But he he kind of confirmed what what uh, Dame Dash has always been talking about that you know, Leo Cohen split up Rockefeller for his you know his own benefit, and that was that. Um, and he said, oh, I can't say this is true, but he it's you know, come on, why would you even say that? And <laughs> this guy's a mess, bro. I I, I mean, what's there to like? Um, this is Jordan Tao with JT News. Appreciate you guys. Check out the new video by Gutter Snipes featuring Rock to Star HNWB out now, streaming on all platforms. And I'll check you guys in the next one. Peace.